This is Italian football lover channel my friends Germany won 4-2 against Portugal and really Cristiano Ronaldo and Jota scored the goals of Portugal and Ruben Diaz and Rafael Guerrero's own goal for Germany and Howard's and Gossens scored the other, score, other goals of Germany I want to talk about the tactics and analysis of this game you can subscribe to my channel watch my videos thank you very much Germany played in 3-4-2-1 formation of Joachim Löw and really Portugal played in 4-1-4-1 formation uh, really uh, in Portugal uh, this player Danilo played close to a uh, defense line front of the defense line and sometimes uh, in Portugal this center backs Pepe and Ruben Diaz uh, split away to the left and right and uh, this player Danilo uh, dropped deep and came back to between of these two center backs uh, but uh, really uh, Germany played better and effective especially uh, Germany used to wings successfully with Gossens and Kimmy moved higher and wider in every Germany attack and at the same time uh, they made the forward five and um, this Müller and Howard stuck infield with Gnabry and uh, they got into the Portugal uh, box in every Germany attacks and Gossens and Kimmy provided the width but sometimes on the right wing this player Ginter moved higher and wider and when he came to forward Ginter came to forward at the same time Kimmy tuck infield and uh, really uh, Germany made overloaded in Portugal box and made so much pressure but a uh, drooping counter attack for uh, Portugal from the right wing uh, these players uh, long range pass Bernardo Silva's uh, long range pass uh, Jota met the ball here but Jota was playing close to Ginter and uh, he made running behind of Germany defense line and uh, he gave his pass to Cristiano Ronaldo stayed free in the backs uh, Humas was playing one to one versus Ronaldo but he couldn't track Ronaldo and Ronaldo stayed free and scored the first goal of Portugal but really Germany dominated the game all the game Germany dominated uh, this game uh, really Portekis was so ineffective uh, really uh, this player uh, Kimmy uh, centered so good balls uh, into the box and uh, Germany's one goal was disallowed like this Kimmy moved higher and wider uh, his cross uh, pass uh, to the back post uh, Gossens stuck infield he scored the goal but this goal was disallowed by the referee but Germany found the goal like this at the same time again Kimmy uh, again moved higher and wider center to ball to the back post and uh, Gossens uh, at the back post Gossens touched the ball and uh, Ruben Diaz uh, sent the ball uh, and it was uh, Ruben Diaz own goal for Germany uh, really every time this player born Bernardo Silva couldn't chase Gossens Gossens stayed free and at the same time this right back Semedo tuck infield in every Germany attack and Gossens, uh, Gossens found so much empty spaces on the right of Germany and uh, really uh, he was so effective uh, in this game and at the same time uh, this player Jota uh, couldn't track Kimmy and Kimmy stayed free and he go forward easily and found space on the left of Portugal sometimes uh, Danilo came uh, came back to between of the defense line and Danilo made the defense line a uh, five for Portugal uh, but uh, really uh, Germany found the uh, second goal uh, at the same time this time Müller came from the left and he tucked infield uh, he sent the ball to the back post Gnabry received the ball here he gave his pass and uh, this time uh, this player Rafael Guerrero is on goal uh, for Germany and Germany uh, was 2-1 ahead in this game uh, the first half uh, has been finished 2-1 and really uh, Germany's uh, wings flanks were so strong uh, in the beginning of the second half really uh, Portugal made one substitution because this Bernardo Silva was so unsuccessful defensively every time uh, he was uh, reluctant to uh, chase Gossens uh, because of this uh, Renato Sanchez replaced of him and a really other substitution uh, in Portugal uh, this player was so ineffective today Bruno Fernandes out really and Moutinho replaced of him uh, and uh, this player 
Renato Sanchez uh, played and William Carvalho out at the same time. And uh, after these substitutions, Moutinho played here like this on the center of the midfield. And uh, Renato Sanchez, 60 number, played here. And uh, Rafa Silva got into the pitch and he played on the right of the midfield. Uh, really, a uh, Portugal coach uh, tried to make stronger right wing and uh, midfield because Germany was better uh, on the pitch in everywhere uh, of the pitch. Germany was uh, dominated the game uh, before uh, beginning uh, until to the end. Uh, really, uh, but anything has not been changed for uh, this game and. Uh, at the same time, again, uh, Gossens uh, found empty spaces. Uh, he carried the balls to the forward. And for instance, uh, in the uh, third goal of Germany, Gossens brought the ball and he gave his pass into the Portugal box. And Howards got into the uh, box and he scored the third goal of Germany. And Germany was 3-1 uh, ahead uh, with this goal. Uh, really, for instance, uh, at the same time, uh, for the uh, fourth goal of Germany, again Kimmich moved higher and wider, he centered the ball into the penalty area, again Gossens, Gossens tucked infield to Germany box and uh, he scored the goal with his headshot at the back post, really he stayed free and at the same time Semedo and uh, this player Rafa Silva uh, couldn't chase Gossens, they couldn't intercept it. Uh, his position and he scored the fourth goal of Germany with his head and Kimmy made the assist uh, in Gossens goal. Uh, really, uh, after Portugal uh, found one more goal, but before this, uh, Germany made uh, some substitutions in this game. I want to uh, indicate this. And Ilkay Gündoğan and Hummels out and Schule and Emrecan replaced of them and Schule played on the center of the defense here and Emrecan uh, played instead of Ilkay like this Emrecan and uh, on the forward uh, really uh, Howard's out and uh, this player Goretzka replaced of him and uh, Goretzka uh, played uh, more offensively like this Goretzka played more offensively he played front of Emrecan and Kroos after he got into the pitch and Müller and Gnebre played uh, on the forward together but uh, at the same time Gossens out on the left of the midfield in Germany in the second half and Halstenberg replaced of Gossens uh, really uh, in uh, Portugal found to a uh, second goal with Jota uh, really uh, in the second half Portugal uh, developed some dangerous attacks from the left wing back of Germany and uh, a developing attacks like this Ronaldo got into the uh, Germany box and he made assist to Jota scored the goal uh, and the goal was uh, the score was 4-2 with this goal uh, really uh, Germany uh, and at the same time I want to indicate that uh, Renato Sanchez one shot out of the Germany box uh, hit the post and uh, in Portugal attacks uh, really Germany's uh, formation turned in, into 5-3-2 Halstenberg came to left back and Kimmich came to right back they made to defense line 5 Kroos, Emrecan and Goresco came back to midfield he made the midfield 3 uh, Gnebre and Müller played on the forward and uh, other last substitution for Germany in this game Gnebre out and uh, Sane replaced of him uh, Sane and Müller played on the forward after this substitution. Uh, really, uh, Germany dominated the game and they got a really comfortable and uh, convincing win against uh, Portugal in this game. Uh, all my analyses and uh, all my comments uh, like this about Portugal-Germany game. What do you think about this game tactically? You can write your suggestions and comments under my video. And uh, please open up your notification links, notification bells. Thank you very much. See you on my next videos, beautiful people. Bye.